Hello and welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn how you can connect to the Death Star, which is the IBM server that we have over here. So once again, when you are in the VMware environment, as I've taught you in the other tutorial, you will going to double click on the IBM software, which will going to give you this folder. Here we have the shortcut for Death Star. You simply double click on the Death Star shortcut, and it will going to bring about a window. In that window, if no server is already added, you will going to add a new server. If a server is already there, then you will going to simply click on that server and start. The way we have configured the VMware environment for you, we have the Death Star already added for you. That is why you do not need to add the server. But in case if you need to add a server, then you can first start a new session and then you can once the session gets created you can then start the session so you simply click the start then you get this dialog box in this dialog box you enter your username and password once you enter your username and password and you click OK now this gives you the sign-in screen where you can now connect to the IBM server so you once again provide your username and your password. Now one of the great things about this environment is that when you enter your password it doesn't echoes it back. So all you see is a moving cursor. The other thing that you will notice is that it gives you lines and the length of each line is 10 characters. That is an indication that no username, no password, no object name can be more than 10 characters long in this environment. So now when I press enter, the first screen that I see is called initial program. When I press enter again, the second screen that I see is your main menu or your initial menu. Now you have your initial program and you got your initial menu. In our case, we have created this menu and this is one of the menus that we give when you sign in. In order to use this menu, you will notice that this is same across the board for any kind of a menu that you have in this environment, that menu list options with numbers to their left. If you want to use any of these numbers, you simply use the number and then you press enter and that particular item will going to be executed. So if I want to go under programming, I choose option number five and I press enter. So now you will notice that over here, instead of IBMI main menu, it will going to now change to uh, the programming. So as I, as I hit enter, you can see that it changes to programming. We will going to explore this whole environment in another video where I explain you the four different screen types. In this video, we will only going to look at how you can log into that star. 